Hello guys, how you doing today? AKA Channel, AKA Josh Briscoe. What's up? So I decided to play some 40 Winks on the PS1. It's a classic game with very, very demonical problems. I am talking about so much shit, so much floorboards. I mean, this game, it's creative, very artistic, but when you go and play the game, it's a radio frustration to every quiet rejoice. And I'm just saying this by the truth of my limbs and my army boners, because that's what it's about. This game is just fucking fucked up, bro. I'm talking about easy starting, muscle, radiation everywhere. I mean, this is just making you soothe around another timber bar and we'll <laughs> like that shit, dude. It sucks. I don't know why people like this game so much. Um, they don't. <laughs> why am I saying everybody likes this? No. Only a few probably love this game, and the only reason why I love this game, and here's the big old ticket, is because it's creative and it's artistic. And I, I do admit on that. Very creative game, very artistic. It definitely gets a 9.0 slash 10 on that part. And the music is not bad. It's kind of catchy and a little groovy and some sensational twerks and quirky little sensations. But I'm talking about the gameplay. It's a video game. Okay, video game. Okay, it's not the graphics are great, but where's the game? The gameplay, where is it? I don't see a mechanical clockwise device telling me that this game is easy to control. It is not easy to control. It is garbage. I mean, I cannot even fucking functionize. Now I'm trying my best to be very relationalized. That I think that I'm gonna make this a very short review and short quick and spin of what my curving decision is all about on this game. This game is, I'm going to give it about, I say 7.0 slash 10. That's about what I give it to, since the creative and artistic factor and stuff like that. A 7.7 slash 10, I'll say that. Because it's just, it doesn't really have no, you know, factual size of it. I'm just saying, I'm trying to be very honest with you guys, just don't play it for the gameplay. Play it because you want to look at the art. It's like a really cool decisional graphic game for a PS1 at that time. And that's all I got to say. So take care, everybody. And I'll be playing more games that suck ass.